So if you're looking at buying a drum set or you're looking at selling yours and getting a new one, um, kind of the bare minimum requirements I think you should be looking for are kind of what I have set up. A snare drum, a rack tom, and a floor tom, and a kick drum. Um, I feel like if you have those, you're gonna have kind of the, the basic needs as a drummer. And then cymbals, can, you can do just two or you can do three, however, um, but snare, tom, tom, kick, and hi-hat, and a crash cymbal or a ride are gonna be kind of the good basics to have. So for, uh, for a worship context, you're gonna want a little bit bigger drums that uh, provide some a little bit bigger sound to them. So this is a, a nine by 13 inch tom, a 16 by 16 inch four tom, and a uh, 14 by 22 kick drum. And this is actually an eight by 14 snare drum. So my drum's a little bit bigger, so they're giving a bigger sound. But if you're in a smaller church, um, you may want a little bit smaller size drum. So maybe an eight by 12, a five by 14, a 20 inch kick drum, and a 14 inch four tom. It really kind of depends on what you're going for, even to down what type of wood you're wanting or if you're wanting a factory made kit or a custom made kit. Um, there's a lot of different drum companies that are doing a lot of great things. Um, it really just kind of depends on what your budget is, what the room is like, and what sound you're going for. There's plenty of videos on YouTube of, of companies that are demoing their drums so you can get a good idea. Um, I can crank these up to sound like a jazz kit, but they're a little bit bigger so it's going to be a little bit tougher to do that. Um, and I can tune them low to make them kind of sound warm and rumbly for kind of a rock sound. So um, with most drums, you can make them sound um, higher or lower or, or um, kind of fit the model, but there's a, it's a good kind of idea if you're looking for a, a jazz kit to look for a specific kind of jazz style of a kit rather than kind of more of a rock kit. So there's a lot of different factors, like I said, budget, the type of room you're playing in, the, the wood you want, um, whether you want it to be factory made or custom made or all different factors you can look through and spend uh, tons of time researching on. But those are kind of some good ideas if you're looking at getting a new drum set or switching out your current drum set or maybe adding a second drum set. Um, those are all good factors to think about um, when, you're, when you're investigating drums. Hey, thanks for checking out this video. We hope that was really helpful and informative for you. And feel free to check out the other drumming videos we have in this series.